Today, we're going to talk about cable, fiber, and what it all is. Your cable internet is your coppered core giant hunk of plastic that sends electricity down the line to provide you internet. Now, fiber internet, that is a glass tube that has fibers in it that transmits light to provide you internet. This gives you extremely fast speeds if you work with wired two gig up and two gig down, which is also symmetrical speeds. So what you get up is what you're gonna get down, which is different than cable. Not only are you able to download something very quickly, but you're also able to upload something very quickly. So think work files, video conferencing, doorbell camera footage, all of these things that we might not think about in our day-to-day -day lives, we're able to upload those just as fast as we are able to download. So not only are the speeds symmetrical, but they're also extremely fast and you're gonna have less lag, ping, all of those things when you're uploading something. So with your standard cable system, you go to start streaming, your neighbor goes to start streaming, someone goes to start playing games. Everyone's getting on that network all at once. All of a sudden, you guys are all buffering at the same time when you're trying to download your game, watch a movie, watch your show, whatever it is. That's because you're all on the same system. It's sharing upload and download. Basically, what I'm saying is it's not evenly split, the upload and download. It's not just like we each get one piece of the pie. It's So if someone's doing something that's extremely large, all of a sudden you're sitting there when you just got home and you want to enjoy your favorite show or play your game and you can't. Now with fiber, that's not the case. You've got a direct line directly to your home that is only yours. This means you can download multiple files at the same time, stream in every bedroom, play games, do all of the things that you would normally do on the internet without having to worry about sharing with someone else and not being able to do it, having it buffer, all of those things that can be really frustrating, especially after a long day of work. So I hope that helped you learn a little bit more about cable, fiber, how they work, some of the differences between the two. If you guys wanna see more videos on fiber, check out some of the other videos on our channel. And if you wanna see if wired fiber is available in your area, click the link down below or the link in our bio.